Well, I'm here. I'm a, um, a board member with the Wooden Boat Museum, and I've just recently retired and um, from uh, university. I uh, taught in engineering, and I've uh, I come to uh, to give back to the uh, to the boat museum, taking courses here before, and uh, I think they're a great bunch, and um, I'm happy to happy to work with them and try to keep alive some of our traditions in, uh, in Newfoundland with boat building. Uh, I'm trying to learn from Jerome and his little help as he got here. Uh, the reason I'm building this boat, I'm retired. I don't like sitting down and I want to try to retain some of Newfoundland culture. I'm proud of my heritage, not that I know a whole lot about it. And my father came from Petty Harbor fishing well, at a younger age. He got out fishing as quick as he could, but he always loved the boats and I always loved boats myself. And I built a couple little small prams before, simple boats. This one here is quite complicated and uh, it's interesting and challenging. Just trying to get your head around it that it's not as tough as I think it is. It looks so complicated, but once you do it, it seems so, it's like learning the ABCs, it's hard when you get going, right? But once you, once you attain the knowledge, there's nothing to it. I have a summer house in uh, Hans Harbor, and uh, uh, right next door, the community is Winterton, and they have the Wooden Boat Museum and just dropped in there and um, um, uh, seen that they had offered courses and, and I thought it was a really interesting thing to get involved with. So uh, um, uh, certainly uh, and over my, uh, uh, my youth, I was around boats and, and whatnot when I'd spend my summers in, in Great's Cove. And, uh, and uh, so I just thought it was, it was a great thing to get involved with, you know, to try to try to keep our heritage uh, alive somewhat, and uh, um, and uh, to, uh, a, 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 a good thing to do, I guess, and, uh, something to make you feel good.